Hey, this is Nick, and I've had a couple of people ask me what's the easiest way to print off my Super Bowl Squares spreadsheet and how do you enlarge it and make it look bigger? So I'm going to just quickly show you how to do that. So um, first we're going to click the option of leave the squares blank for easy printing. Um, and you say pick the random numbers. So let's say we want to have different uh, numbers for every quarter. And we'll just do um, dollars and Again, score type by per quarter, so generate squares. It's going to be left blank. So here's our empty square grid here. So we want to print this off. And the, the easiest way to do this is just by selection. So you just select the cells that you want to print in order to get like what exactly you want to print. So if you want to include the um, score area over here, select that. If not, let's say you just want to print uh, the grid, you could select this like this. Okay, so then you go to File, Print, uh, select your printer. So you can see here where it, um, it's not, it's it's doing a, the default print area, not what I selected. Uh, so what you go over here is to Settings, Change to Print Selection, and it'll change that to exactly what the cells that I had selected. And then so next it's just making it bigger to fit the, the entire page. So first thing you want to do is probably change the landscape to fill it out more. And then you can go down here to scaling and change to fit on one sheet. Or you can try different uh, custom scaling options or other uh, different scaling to just make it bigger print quality and so on. And you can adjust your margins, delete those. You know, if you want to make it closer, about center it or whatever. So there's diff different settings you can play with uh, to blow it up to make it bigger. Uh, and then when you're ready, hit print. So you can print out the the blank grid, have everybody write their names in, and then when you're ready to do the numbers, you can say randomize, and it'll add the random numbers in there. And then you can just uh, pencil those into your sheet after everybody entered their name in. So there you have it. That's how you. Uh, print out a Excel spreadsheet.